oh, where do we even start? In the latest episode of As the Palace Turns, our favorite ex-royal rebels, Harry and Meghan, have been ceremoniously kicked to the curb, or should we say, subtly shoved off the royal family's digital pedestal. It seems like someone at the palace finally woke up on the wrong side of the bed and decided it was high time to give these two the downgrade of the century. So what's the juicy scoop? Sit tight, because this one's a doozy. Once basking in the glory of royal limelight, Harry and Meghan found themselves playing a game of hide-and-seek on the royal family's website. Vanishing faster than Harry's hairline, only to pop back up after the internet had a collective meltdown. But, oh, the horror when they did reappear. No longer rubbing digital elbows with the likes of Princess Alexandra and Prince Andrew, our dynamic duo was relegated to the equivalent of the royal website's basement, right under the Duke of York. Ouch. Now let's not forget, these two decided to bid adieu to their royal daobs back in 2020, yet here we are, four years later, still talking about their place on a website. But last night, the plot thickened. Their once glowing portraits and riveting biographies mysteriously disappeared, only to be replaced by what can only be described as a pamphlet-sized joint bio tucked away beneath Prince Andrew's own scandal-shadowed profile. But wait, there's more. The Sussex's entry, now a shadow of its former self, modestly mentions their step back from royal duties, while Prince Andrew's profile got a trim, starting with his infamous step back over the Epstein scandal. The palace seems to be on a roll with these demotions, but when it comes to Harry and Meghan, they've been tight-lipped, dodging questions about why the couple remained on the site after trading in their royal gigs for Hollywood lights and Oprah interviews. Speculation was that the palace's web team was just dragging their feet, taking their sweet time updating the site post-Queen Elizabeth's passing. Harry's profile used to boast about his royal lineage and military accolades, complete with glossy pics. Meghan's, a tad shorter, highlighted her acting career and brief stint as a royal philanthropist. But now, they've been crammed into a single budget-friendly biography. Gone are the days of Meghan being hailed as an activist and humanitarian. Now, she's been demoted to actress and blogger pre-marriage. Talk about a downgrade. They've even been stripped of individual profiles, a royal snub if there ever was one. Social media had a field day, with comments ranging from cheeky celebrations of their removal to snarky observations about their website demotion. Some suggested this might be the palace's passive-aggressive way of keeping Harry and Meghan in line, like, behave, or you'll be wiped from royal memory. In this saga of royal drama, Harry and Meghan's digital demotion has been nothing short of a deliciously petty move by the palace, serving as a stark reminder that in the world of royal hierarchy, not all exits are graceful, and certainly not all comebacks are triumphant.